Hi, this is Amy from the LT Store. We are here with Mike from Iron Ridge. Hello, Amy. Hi there. So we are going to talk about grounding, That's wrapping right. grounding, the, the, the way it was and the way it is now with Iron Ridge's awesome integrated grounding. Great. Well, I'm excited to show you. I have a small uh, demo module so we can kind of take a look at the technology. Um, years ago, the installers would have to put a grounding lug on the back of every module and then run copper from lug to lug across the whole array in order to bond that on the roof. And then down onto each rail as then, well. Yes, exactly right. Uh -huh. You have to bond your rails as well. There's a lot of copper and a lot of lugs on the roof, which not only is money spent on the material, but your labor cost is going through the roof at that point too. Um, Iron Ridge and uh, the rest of the industry was listening to the customers saying that this was uh, not ideal. So um, the next thing that people did instead of using lugs, was they came up with a grounding washer, uh, commonly called a weeb, um, that was made by Wiley Industries and then uh, subsequently adopted by the industry. Uh, the name weeb stuck, and people were using them, um, as you can see, by mounting it to the channel on the rail. Uh, this little washer acted sort of like a star washer. It would get through the aluminum anodization uh, on both the rail and on the underside of the module so that when pressed together and clamped down uh, that would form an electrical bond between your module and your rail. Um, still a better option than using grounding uh, lugs but still it was an extra part on the roof and an extra part you had to buy and an extra part you had to inventory. And if you had to move the rail, uh, move the, the module you had to throw out that weed Great and point. use a whole new one. Great point, yes. There's little dimples here that pierce that anodization they're only good for one use though, yeah. and after that they get compressed. So it was only good for one time. If you had to replace an inverter or change something on the roof, you'd have to get a new one. Um, so Iron Ridge, one of the things that uh, originally endeared us to installers was we came up with a way to put everything into one product. Uh, so you'd have your grounding through your mid clamp. You already have to use this to attach the module to the rail. Why not have grounding in here too? Um, so well, the way that works, and it's going to be very hard to see, but there are small ridges on the bottom of the T-bolt. Yeah. Uh, they go into the rail channel and get through the anodization in the channel. Then there are some larger sized uh, ridges, some kind of teeth looking things, on the module mid clamp right there. That's going to, again, bite through the anodization on the top of the module. So now you're bonded to the module from up here the rail through down here, so it's all electrically bonded to itself. Um, you now then just have to do a lug at the end of the rail, and only one per row. So typically a, a row has two rails on it. You only have to bond one of those rails to the rest of the array. So you're taking your lug count down by 90%. Yeah. You're taking your copper use way down, uh, and you don't have to have extra washers uh, on the roof that you're paying, you know, a buck or two each, uh, and you can only use once. This is able to be used multiple times if you have to swap something out later. Um, it's already, you know, torque tested, engineered, and UL twenty seven hundred three approved. Nice. Um, it's really a time saver yeah. on the roof. So yeah. uh, that was that was something that we listened to customers' feedback and developed this for them. And you and I'm seeing this is this is a darker one. Yeah. So you've got the the dark. Uh, dark clamps for yeah. dark modules. If you had a module with a, a black anodization on it, um, you could match that to the module and then also to our black rail. Um, you can get all that through all the the uh, silver frame modules. Maybe you don't want to have a black mid clamp, so of course we do have the silver integrated grounding mid clamp. Mm -hmm. um, this is approved for all over the U.S., including L.A. County. We're one of the only manufacturers that can do integrated grounding oh, in L.A. Yeah. County. It's uh, it's a tricky county, and uh, we're happy to be approved there too. Excellent. Well, thank you very much for showing that to us. Thank and you, Amy. I am Amy from the Alti Store here with Mike from Iron Ridge. And check out more of our videos and go to our website at altistore.com where we're making renewable doable.